So I know what you're thinking. Did this bitch just crawl out of a sewer trying to sneak into Van's Warped Tour or something. Um, in fact, I did not do that. The reality is that it is 1.42 in the morning and I can't sleep. I can never sleep. Now, the dear Emma Chamberlain just uploaded a video when she said she's cleaning out her closet and I got really excited because I like closet cleaning videos. Turns out, uh, no, she was just shopping. So I figured I'd do the cleaning. And instead of spending money after cleaning my closet, hopefully I'm gonna make some money because I'm gonna be going to Play-Dohs where they will most definitely uh, reject everything that I bring them. So this, these are all of my shirts. Now I counted it and there are 52 of them hanging in here. I have very, very limited space here. Those are some onesies that we don't talk about, okay? We, we don't mention these. Anyway, here's all the shirts. We're gonna be going through every single one of these and getting rid of, hopefully, 33% of these bitches right here. Next, we have this side, which is full of my coats and sweaters and that kind of thing. Then we have this here. That's, um, that's, that's something that we're not going to talk about right now. Now, the reason I'm doing this video is because I'm going back to school in um, less than a month now. And I don't want to bring all these clothes back to me. It's, I feel like it's really healthy to do a little preschool, preschool purge. I'm sorry. First item, this jacket thrifted it a couple months ago and it is my favorite thing that I own. So we're keeping her. This shirt belongs to my sister who lives in Madagascar. She left it here when she visited and she is not getting it back. This is probably the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. It definitely also belonged to my sister. I'm sorry, Ashley, I'm getting rid of this. This belongs to my best friend. Do I plan on ever returning this to her? Absolutely not. I love this shirt with all my heart, so... She's staying in my closet. It's hideous. I'm getting rid of it. <laughs> this shirt I bought kind of recently. I liked that it was like a dainty, like I'm a dainty little girl. I've only worn it like two or three times. I'm gonna give it some more shots. It's a keeper. I don't like this shirt enough to keep it. This is Big Boy, the official underscore Big Boy. He's the only person whose merch I have ever bought. I also cropped it and it's way too short, but I'm not getting rid of this because it's Big Boy. I spent my hard earned money on it. I'm supporting him. I haven't worn this in at least a year. I've kept this shirt through a couple, a couple runs. I brought it to school with me. I never wore it. This is my sweetie baby honey. I always had such big intentions to wear this. This is a shirt that my best friend got me, vintage Nike sweatshirt, keep. I'm gonna start going through these a lot faster so we can we can get through this together. This shirt just has a special place in my heart and for that reason, I'm keeping it. This was an old sorority shirt, Sigma Alpha. Espelon, Alpha Delta Pi, and Kappa Alpha. I don't give a shit. I just like this shirt, okay? I like how it falls on my body, and so I'm keeping it. I never end up wearing it. My dear ex-boyfriend bought this for me. No, it's just not it. Bless your heart, sweetie pie, thank you. Navy blue mock neck. I like it. I just wanna know what itty bitty little human being this is a top for, because it's not me. Actually, I wore this shirt like exactly one year ago and it fit great. College does something to you, kids. This is my favorite shirt that I own. It has horses on it. She's just perfect in every way. boring, you're plain, you're not it, and I don't want to see you ever again. Get out of my face, you're chopped, goodbye. Now this bitch, she's kind of plain on the back. She kind of looks like she has an exoskeleton, like the underbelly of a cockroach. However, she looks great without a bra on and she's quick, easy, love it. Another plain Jane boring. I was rooting for you, we were all rooting for you. <laughs> Ah, 
God bless this fucking romper. I dated a basic, basic boy a couple years ago and I had to go to a goddamn social gathering, what was it called? A derby party where the horses raced. I, I wore this to try and not look like such a freak. This shirt fucking slaps. This shirt is the, I don't listen to it. I'm not trying to be a fake fan. This shirt is amazing. This is also another one of my favorite shirts. Look at this dainty little, the flower child. I like driving or listening to Modest Mouse. Oh, let's stop at the peach stand and pick up some peaches. Can you take a photo of me in this? Ow. Oh, fuck. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Instant karma for me being a bitch. Not really. It's what I aspire to be. I'm just a little bit too hard for that. I'm a little bit too hard to have picnics in a field next to dandelions. I got allergies. Fuck a dandelion. I, I didn't thrift this. I bought this at a Tommy Hilfiger store for like 25 or $30, like three years ago. And for that reason, I can't get rid of it. This shirt once belonged to a love of mine who is no longer a love of mine, but the shirt is really, really cute. And I always get so many compliments when I wear it, but I feel really, really weird wearing it. So I don't wear it that often. I also feel weird getting rid of it. So here we are. Look at that. Look at how much room I have. And look at all this damage that's been done. All of those. Except that. That's my... This is my keep. Get the fuck back over there. Oh shit. Now, is the back of my hair teased? Probably not, but it makes my head look a lot smaller when I wear my hair all big. Watch till the end of the video and I'll brush it out because I know there's gonna be some people who are just gonna be like, I wanted her to brush her hair this entire time. Mm -hmm. I just wanna brush her hair. Well, guess what? I'll brush it at the end. That was unnecessarily aggressive and I apologize. Aha. We meet our first victim. These are a size four jeans that I probably wouldn't fit anymore because um, I went to college and sometimes you get a little bit thicker or a lot of bit thicker and it sucks, but hey, 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 hey. I wouldn't want to fit these ugly pieces of shit anyway. Also, I don't care what anyone says, American evil jeans make your butt look flat. It makes everyone's butt look flat. Avoid them. What? I'm, I'm confused. I don't know whose this is. The number you have dialed has been changed. The new number. It's like an hour later. It, I think it's 3.17 in the morning and I'm getting tired. The number you have dialed. We're down to the final section, boys. This is a freaking queen. My track spikes. Ow! Oh my god, I wasn't like... Wow, wow. For anyone who didn't know, I am a huge Ralph Macchio fan. It's kind of unhealthy how big of a Ralph Macchio fan I am. This is my shit. This is my navy blue corduroy fucking jacket. I put it over everything. Look at all those hangers. Y'all, this is everything I'm getting rid of. A lot of stuff. 
Haven't counted quite all the numbers yet. Look at all that. How exciting. I'm so excited to get rid of all this stuff. Uh, gonna feel like a new woman. Okay guys, so I counted the final numbers. I could imagine some things will get lost and all messed up um, between the count in the video and what I've counted. But what I have found, these are my numbers. I'm getting rid of 21 tops, 7 shorts, 4 pants, 6 jackets, and 5 pairs of shoes. <laughs>